At the age of 65, a West Odessa man is building his own type of sports complex for the children in his community. The reason, he says, it's for their safety, but it might just be working to help him even more than the children. CBS 7's Lauren Landman visited the newly fenced-in soccer fields tonight. She joins us now with the story behind it. Lauren? Jay Tatum, the man is considered retired, and after an accident in the oil field years ago, he's also considered disabled. But if you saw him out on those fields, you probably wouldn't believe me. Two years ago, the plot of land at the intersection of Knox and Edith in West Odessa sat bare and silent. But that was before two men decided to build their dreams. The father-son duo of Jesus and Jesse Carranza built their family around one thing. It was soccer and soccer and soccer and soccer. For the majority of his life, Jesus has taught a countless number of soccer teams. Aside from sport, for us, it's devotion. It was his life, that is, until an oil field accident left him bedridden. I mean, he would just be down, he didn't want to do anything, he just... He saw himself hurting. He didn't want to be a, a struggle for anyone. But slowly, Jesus pulled himself back up. At times, even coaching from a wheelchair, he created his own soccer academy and now brings his teams here to train them. Jesus built the facility with his bare hands from the ground up, giving him motivation to keep moving every day. It's nice. It's nice to know that he still does. He still has that smile that I used to see on him. And now it's even bigger because he, he's handing it out to other people. For Jesus, the soccer field is his therapy and one that helped him score a new outlook on life. <laughs> Jesus trains both boys and girls in his soccer academy. If you would like to sign your child up or join a league, you can do so by giving him a call at 557-3112. In the studio, I'm Lauren Landman, CBS 7 News.